Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here and you are welcome to another video on the Canva Design Critique. Today we are going to be looking at a design that was sent to me by a very interesting Canva fan. So let's dive into it and let's see how we are going to improve the design. So before we get started into it, um, I know, yes, I said we are going to dive into it, but before we get started into it, um, I want to recommend Canva Pro to you. So I have a special link in the description box below that can help you to get Canva Pro at a very good price or even if you want to try Canva Pro for 30 days for absolutely free. And without any much ado, I also want to add this to it. <laughs> just in case you want me to uh, make a video about me improving upon your design you can send me an email okay at um benjaminmino at gmail.com so just send me an email and um with the editable link to be precise with the editable link so that i can be able to make edits on your design um so that in that case when you take a look at your design you'll be able to see the edits i have made on it so yes let's dive into canva and let's get started today so this is the design that was sent to me and um one interesting thing is before i make any of these tutorials i have no idea on whatsoever i am going to do so it's just like off the bat just diving into it and just seeing how best i can do this without preparing for the video so looking at it you know i understand yes this is interesting you know interesting elements in here but i feel that um the text is not standing out enough even though the colors are okay but it's not really standing out enough so what i think i would do um you know just out of it i see there's so many elements here i don't even know oh, okay so this is the sp spread thing over here okay so i'll just select everything over here and um, i will paste it over here okay and this series is not me claiming to be a pro okay it's just me trying to see how best i can just edit or improve designs without even preparing for them so yeah okay then i just maybe um drop this down a little bit so with this um religious soldiers i would maybe increase them and uh, maybe okay have it here like this and maybe this one should just come down okay and we can have this one also down here then i would increase this a little bit because i think everything is looking good but i just want this text to stand out okay so maybe instead of using noun uh i didn't even okay so let me just se select everything and copy okay then i will just um you know okay so i duplicate it and i'll just select all and delete okay then i just add the edits i did okay so fantastic okay so you can see um like i was saying i want this to stand out so i would change the text so i would go for something like uh, maybe leaks pattern l-e-a-g-u-e -E. okay so um it should come up quickly and um, i should be able to change the text okay so this is the leaks pattern um typeface i want to use and i see you have it looks like you have some shadow to it yeah okay so i will just turn it off and um i would say maybe happy can be on top then republic day okay so i would maybe clear all of this and i'll center this text okay and maybe put position it here okay and um, i'll just drop it here then maybe i can duplicate it you know position it down here and i can just see the republic day over here so republic um day okay so then i can you know increase size over here then i'll select you know these um wow there are so many elements in here okay so i'll select just all of this and no I wanted just the text okay so I just unselect these ones and I will drop this one down a little bit okay so um, happy Republic Day so I can increase this way or and I can even make it all caps okay so make it all caps position it here and uh, maybe reduce it a little bit then position and center okay so then we can also make this all caps 
and I can put it here okay but what we can also do is instead of having all the text the same I can change this text okay so maybe happy no I not that's not how to spell happy okay so I will come here okay and turn this thing off then maybe you search for a script font so as um, there is one like um, Amsterdam okay so any of these ones I believe should work maybe Amsterdam one okay then I increase um, the size then I can change the color to maybe um, what you have over here okay so this can be here I can just say happy okay and bring it in front and you can see how I have it over here then maybe I can you know send this one out a little bit more okay then maybe this one can also come down a little bit then I'll just position this one over here so with this maybe I'll just change the you know the text so um, just to make everything look maybe interesting to me I can change it to poppins and I know I'm using more than um, you know three fonts which um, I think it's something you know you should be able to do only if you are very comfortable or you actually know what you are looking for okay so i'll don't group i see you grouped everything okay, so this is the two and a six okay so maybe i just delete all of this just to keep everything simple okay so i come here and i just do 26 general you understand then close this up maybe delete this one first increase the size a little bit position it here and maybe drag it here okay so you can see what we are doing and I maybe can drop this one down a little bit and yes this is what I would go for in terms of the design you can see how it's looking because um, I wanted to give more room to the happy Republic day because I feel you know that needs to stand out because in the initial design um, it wasn't standing out enough okay and I just you know change the text and also change this text over here just to be able to make um, you know it look a little bit interesting and to create some sort of balance because if everything goes on here the design wouldn't have looked balanced I mean with the date if it came on here it wouldn't have been looking balanced that's why I position it here so that everything can look balanced you know in a way and um, I also reduce you know these things just push them up and then push this ones down so that we can have enough white space on our design so this is what i was able to do and yeah so the two designs are what you see on the, um, on your screen right now and just let me know in the comment section what you think about it if i actually did something good or i think you know you think i actually messed <laughs> everything up just let me know in the comment section and yes if you have been able to stick around to this part of this video then i must say that you are really the best you understand you are really the best i really appreciate you don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and don't forget to send me your designs at benjaminmino at gmail.com okay and make sure you are sending me the editable link of your design so that i can make a video like this to improve upon your design and yes the name is benjamin don't forget there is no limit to creativity i would see you in my next video